Let's investigate a tried and tested teaching strategy that develops the problem solving, understanding and capacity of every child. With this teaching strategy, the goal is not to have every child solve a problem today. The goal is to increase every child's problem solving understanding and capacity. The parts of this teaching strategy are 1. Review the mathematical concept. 2. Solve level 1 of the problem together. 3. Solve level 2 of the problem guided. 4. Solve a differentiated level of the problem independently. We will now review the concept by asking Socratic strategic questions, having children ask one another the questions, and answer one another's questions, and then share with the class. Part 2. Solve level 1 of the problem together. To prepare for this, we need a problem on a slide with everything covered, except for the part that is asking us to find something out. Problem solving steps on the slide. This is a whole class teaching strategy, because we will use all of the brains in the classroom, to investigate and learn together. Level 1 of the problem should allow every child access. For this course, we've chosen an adult level problem. Part 3. Solve level 2 of the problem guided. To prepare for this, we need a little higher level of the problem on a slide with everything covered, except for the part that is asking us to find something out. Problem solving steps on the slide. This is a whole class teaching strategy that involves the children discussing in strategic pairs, as they use both brains to investigate and learn together. Level 2 of the problem should allow every child access, by way of their strategic pairing. For this course, we've chosen an adult level problem. Part 4. Solve a differentiated level of the problem, independently. To prepare for this, we need three levels of the problem on a slide with everything covered, except for the parts that are asking us to find something out. Problem solving steps on the slide. Level 1 of the problem should be similar to the first problem that we solved together. Level 2 of the problem should be similar to the second problem that the children solved guided. Level 3 of the problem should have a little more complexity. This is a whole class teaching strategy that involves the children investigating solving a problem independently. <laughs>